The local hunting community tonight mourns the loss of a legend. Tim Grounds, who revolutionized waterfowl hunting with his goose and duck calls, died in an ATV crash last night. Fellow hunters tell News 3's Brooks Slyer they'll remember Grounds as a friend and a mentor. Gay Weiss can remember the first time he met Tim Grounds, someone he looked up to even years before that moment. Be honest, I was kind of kind of scared scared at first. I was kind of like you know didn't know what to expect, and then just you get to know him. He's such a warm-hearted individual that was just so willing to help. Weiss began taking goose call lessons from Grounds at just 12 years old. He was able to accelerate me a lot quicker than I was ever going to be able to on my own. Eventually, Weiss competed in the World Championships, which Grounds won three times. In the first year, I was like, I don't want to go. I shouldn't go. I'm not ready. And he, he told me to go anyway. But it's the night he won his last junior Mason Dixon competition that he will never forget. Tim jumped on stage and he just gave me, I mean, it almost hurt the bear hug he gave me. Just, and he just said, he said, that's the way to do it. That's what I like to hear. Grounds, who was 60 years old, passed away Sunday evening in an ATV accident at his hunting club on Grassy Road. The Williamson County Coroner's Office believes Grounds was spraying weeds when the vehicle overturned and rolled down a small embankment, landing on top of him. <laughs> Rodney Mandrell was friends with Grounds for 25 years, hunting with him throughout southern Illinois and even making trips to South Dakota. I mean, he's, he is a, he's the godfather of goose calling. I mean, he is it when it comes to goose calls. He, 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 took, he took it to a whole nother level. But Mandrell says he'll be remembered for much more than his hunting skills. And just about any aspect of life, even outside of waterfowl hunting, Tim, you know, always give his all and, and to help people and, and kids. Brooks Slyer, News 3. Tim Grounds is survived by his parents, Bill and Judah, as well as his son, Hunter, who is the youngest person to win the Senior World Goose Calling Championship at the age of 16 back in 2003. Funeral arrangements are pending.